Europe's 2024 Ford Kuga gets a facelift today with improved infotainment and lower prices. A new grille, headlights, bumper and hood give the car a boxier, more SUV-like design that dilutes the family connection to the Focus hatch, but feels more in tune with modern trends. There's now a light bar running across the leading edge of the hood, for instance, which extends across the upper part of the headlight and gives the car a newfound assertiveness. Titanium, ST-Line and Active trim grades all get their own look. But perhaps the most successful of those is Active, whose black fender and sill moldings and faux skid plates give her the Kuga a definite SUV-like demeanor. It also offers 10 mm of extra ride height to back that up, though you're unlikely to feel any benefit when driving. Buyers looking for something more performance-minded should go for the ST-Line, though again, it's mostly just an appearance package, and Ford still doesn't offer a genuine Kuga Street. There's some equally big news inside, where a 13.2-inch touchscreen runs Ford's latest SYNC 4 software and is claimed to possess double the processing power of the outgoing setup. It has 5G connectivity, wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, plus Alexa built-in for improved voice command functionality. While a new trailer tow navigation feature lets drivers select a route that avoids awkward turns and low bridges. Ford's engineers have been busy under the hood, too. The base engine is a 148 horsepower, 150 PS, 1.5 liter EcoBoost, and the only alternatives are hybrids. There are two regular 2.5 liter hybrids, one sending 178 horsepower, 180 PS, to the just the front wheels and a second sharing 181 horsepower, 183 PS, between all four, whereas the sole outgoing Kuga hybrid was a 187 horsepower, 190 PS, front driver. A PHEV version of the 2.5 continues to head the range, but it now pumps out 240 horsepower, 243 PS, to the front wheels, instead of 222 horsepower, 225 PS.